Timu, Shopify dropshipping, how to dropship products from Timu to Shopify. Hello everyone, welcome back to another video. I hope you all are doing great and are having an amazing and absolutely incredible day. I bring you back with yet another video and in this video we're going to be talking about how you're going to be transferring products or importing products from Timu or Temu, or however you want to pronounce it, to your Shopify, okay? Now obviously here's your Temu.com and once you're in Temu, basically over here, uh, you know, there's uh, different types of uh, widgets and users that uh, you can choose. And uh, obviously Temu is a very, very famous store. Uh, it's, you could say, quite the best seller, to be honest, because all the products on this are, you know, at a good price. And they also give you a variety of a lot of different products. So uh, obviously, it's a very good website to, you know, do e-commerce storing at and to buy products at. It's really amazing stuff. Now, to find, you know, in-depth products on Temu and to actually import those products, obviously, we're going to need some type of extra provider. So, you know, there's different things like Importify, you know, Deezers, Enhancer, and a whole lot of other things. Uh, in this case, you know, you can use uh, Importify for yourself. You can use uh, any other, you know, basic free provider that you can get. And obviously, you're going to need to add those providers into your Shopify's sales channel or apps channel. But we're going to get into that in a second. The best thing about Temu is that you can actually import bestseller products with quite decent pricing. And obviously, you're drop shipping, so you're going to get a strong commission out of these products, which is also pretty incredible. And the thing about Temu is that, you know, there's a lot of drop shipping providers that, you know, ban your store because they think it's a copyright issue and all but that's the fun thing about temu they never copyright you for the products because like in my experience at least they don't do it so you know really easy and really impressive stuff so importing products from temu and you know actually drop shipping from temu has never been easier so to start things off what we're going to be doing is we're going to come over to the apps channel go on all recommended apps and go over to the shopify app store now, once you come to the Shopify app store over here, what you're going to do is you're going to go to the search box up here. And in the search box, we're going to write Importify. You're going to write Importify and you're going to click on search. And once we do that, it's going to basically bring us here. So you can see a few things, you know, Auto DS, all in one drop shipping, Dropify drop shipping, wide old reviews, upsells in 40 plus. And then you see Importify easy drop shipping. Now, the reason I'm telling you to add Importify is because Importify allows us to drop ship from users that not a lot of other people allow us to do. So Importify allows us. AliExpress, Amazon, which is obvious, Shine, Alibaba, Etsy, and Timu, which is not very common. So we can see that Timu is allowed from the providers at Importify. So yeah, now you're probably wondering what are we going to do with this? So you're going to install this into your Shopify apps. And as you can see, I have Importify right here. So you can open up Importify and uh, they're going to give you a few different things to add on to. So obviously they have this plan. If you choose a plan, you get a one day free trial for yourself as well, which is pretty nice. So you can go with that one day free trial if you want to. But uh, obviously, it's going to cut the money off for the plans as well. So, yeah, you're going to want to, you know, do this uh, pretty, you could say, like, think about it if you want to go with a plan. Now, if you want to go with a plan, I would say, obviously, premium is the best one because most people use this. And to most people, it's really helpful as well but if you're starting off and if you don't want to waste a lot of money you can just go with your basic plan now once you've gone with your basic plan from there on out what you are going to want to do is you're going to basically go ahead and you are going to add your you know details of card and stuff which are obviously going to be paid through your shopify now obviously once we've gotten the idea of this what we're going to do from here is we're going to come over to Timu and we're going to actually start importing products. But to import products to your Importify import list, what you're going to do is you're going to come to a new tab and you're going to write Importify extension. That is what we're going to go to. 
and here it says importify product importer this is exactly what we want so just go over ahead to this and once you come over here you're going to add the importify product importer extension to opera now once you've added your product extension into opera it's going to look a bit like this okay importify product importer now obviously once you've added that you're going to go to the website that you actually want to import the products from okay so in our case we want to import the products from timu so what you're going to do is you're going to go to a product you know any product obviously we're in best sellers and i'm going to go to overall best sellers and there's you know tons and tons of different best sellers that you can go with um i'd say in my case let's go with yeah i guess the most sold are the led motion sensors so i'm just going to go with this 36,000 and we can see 100,000 plus are sold and on Timo you can see 36,254 are sold because it has those much reviews and it goes off for a good price as well. So what you're going to do over here is here you're going to click on your extension and it's going to open this up for you. So obviously you can go into the instructions to see how you're going to add this to your store so you're going to obviously import it. Click the add button on the top of your left screen which is going to come over here and then you're going to click on add to your store or you can just click on import now okay just come to the product click on import now and what this will do is we'll basically import this specific product over here okay this specific product that you can see it's going to come here into your uh, you know importify lister and in your importify lister you're just going to go to import list and inside of import list you're going to find the product so from the import list, what you're going to do is you're going to take the products out. OK, and how you're going to take them out is you're going to go on the products and one by one, you're going to send them off to your store or vendor. And in our case, it's going to be our Shopify because we've connected it through the app and sales channel in the app market. Now, once you've connected your providers and connected your vendors, you're going to be pretty good to go from there. OK, it's going to be really easy and it's going to be really simple working. So just import your providers and once you've done that your products are going to appear over here and same you're going to do with product listings and order fulfillment you're going to come over obviously once someone orders a product from you you're going to come over to your importify dashboard and once you come to the importify dashboard what you're going to do over here again go to import list and then go to orders and obviously you're going to tell the importify lot over here that hey my order has been fulfilled i have gotten the money and everything is good to go so you're just gonna input that over here tell them to the people in importify and yeah that's going to be order fulfillment fulfill it from here as well and things are going to be good to go so yeah that's uh, basically about it for this video now if you enjoyed watching it please do make sure to drop down a like to this video and subscribe to the channel because that truly helps me out a lot and if you want to watch more videos with topics related to this, please do make sure to drop down a comment and uh, I will make the video as soon as possible. Yeah, that's pretty much about it for this video. Thank you for watching until the end and I'll see all of you next time. Goodbye.